Well, good day, pilots. Welcome back to Microsoft Flight Sim. And uh, today we got this thing downloaded here. It's quite goofy. <laughs> We're going to give it a shot here anyways. And uh, we are taking off from... I can't read that, but it's way over in Europe here. <laughs> way, 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 way over. Um, almost, I guess, to... China, sort of, kind of, just on the edge of, uh, you know, why do these all have question marks? Hmm. On the edge of the brightness here. So, where were we now? Lost my spot already. <laughs> Anyways, um, where did we start? I think it was, oh, did I lose my spot already? Oh, Bangkok, that'll work. Uh, sure, there's even someone here already. Uh, okay, so let's set departure. I can't believe I lost my where I was there. Anyways, I'm not, of course, familiar with this area. So, yes, uh, but this is like a tail dragger. Um, sort of like what they would use, kind of, maybe a little bit too big of a tire, but um, what they would use for, like, bush landings and stuff and landed on like you know river bed kind of thingies and real rough areas kind of thing uh, what do they call it there's a bush pilot or something like that I think they call them so we're gonna load that up we're gonna take it for a little spin I haven't flown it yet I have no idea how it goes yet it might not even roll down the runway right I, I don't know larger than uh, 747 by an inch I think that said there <laughs> so it's a little overkill but she should uh, touch down pretty pretty nice, you would think. But uh, we shall see. Th regular 35-inch bush wheel that said there or something like that. I missed that one again. Fifty-inch prototypes. Holy Alaskan. Three times as much regular 35-inch bush wheels. Wow. So if she ever loads here, we'll get a look at her and fire it up here and see uh, how she flies. Be one heck of a a drag in the air, you would think, with those great big things hanging there and, you know, huge tires. So, oh, Bangkok. All right, the sun is just going down, so we've got to figure out how to start this thing. Uh, let's look like lights. Avionics on, I guess we need that. Uh... Ignition on. We need that. Is there fuel anywhere? Not seeing much. There is a throttle there. And the flaps there. Everything's all mechanical. Fly by the wires, apparently. And the rods and the everything. <laughs> so, let's see. Oh, that's it. Must be no fuel cut off anywhere. Okay. There's my avionics. That's all I get. It's interesting. Let's have a look at her on the outside here. Look at the size of these things. Bigger than a 747 wheel. Holy. Boy, you'd even have some great big uh, brakes on that thing to stop that thing, wouldn't you? Well, let's start rolling out here, I guess. Uh, check everything, make sure everything's... Yeah, seems all good. Well, she rolls anyways. Kind of surprised Ground at that. CGGNP3022 with Gulf request taxi to the active straight out departure. Gonna need a big engine, I think, to push these tires. Holy Contact three. Holy, you want me to go way down there? Why don't we just turn here and take off here? Better do her right, I guess. Oh, there's a truck trying to catch me. Holy cow. There's a bus on my tail. Literally. Jeez, bud. <laughs> he's coming this way, too. Uh, no, he stopped. Oh, he is coming this way. Oh, no, he went that way. Okay. Man, it's got to say. I guess we'll put a little bit of flap down. Uh, 15. Yeah, 35 is probably too much. Give her a 15. I like in around 20-ish area, but 15 uh, is all right, I think. 
give her a little more speed here. It seems to be pulling to the left a lot for some reason. I don't know if that's just me or I just don't have enough air speed up over the tail yet. And there's a truck coming right for me. Who's going to win? Really don't think I need to go to the end. I'll be off the ground probably by here by a long time. Don't know what the takeoff speed is on this thing, but I guess we'll find out. It'll probably be up pretty darn quick. I would think anyways. <clears throat> Whoa. Easy, easy. <laughs> the tail was starting to come up already on me. Did you see that? It's going about 20 there, and it was starting to lift up already. That's a long uh, taxi here. I just want to get to the end of it. Holy cow, it's tuning again. Very sensitive. My goodness, it's going to be interesting taking this off. Yeah, it was already up in the air a bit there. That's interesting. Going too fast, I guess. Oh, she sure slows down fast, though, when you let the throttle off. My goodness. Wow. That's amazing. Must be wanting me to go way to the other end here now. If I would have known that, I would have started at the other end here. But it looks like a plane coming in, maybe. Is there something in the sky straight ahead of us? Looks like it. Let's load up our map here. That's well, us. There's one down the other end there and should be a plane yeah there he is he's coming in okay this looks like uh, quite the developed area that's uh, the guy that was just coming in okay, let's shorten that a bit Somebody's coming in, it looks like, maybe. I think it's got lots of time. I could definitely cross the runway, but I think it wants me to actually go down the runway. Well, now it says continue, really? I'm going to get killed here, you knob. That wants me to hold. Man, I wish they'd make up their mind. Roger, CGG NP tree zero two two. Now this is interesting because why? Why couldn't I taxi down here further? Why does it want me to cross? Where does it want me to go here? It wants me to taxi right down the runway. That makes no sense to me. I don't need that much runway. I'm just going to turn and take off and go that way. Heck with it. <laughs> I don't know if this guy's still coming in or he's probably a long way out. Where the heck is he? There's nobody even coming in now. Where is he? I see him there. Oh, there he is. Oh, fuck. I'd be long gone by then. Okay, I'm just going to go to the heck with him. I don't know, this plane will take off in like hardly any runway, I think. Let's see here. I'm just going to go for it here. I got piles of time. Maybe he's not doing a touch and go. Ooh, didn't take long to get that tail up. Yeah, it's already up. Look. <laughs> I didn't think it was going to take that long. It's like instant up. Too bad, I'm off. Deal with it, lady. <laughs> Approach CGG and P Tray 02 to West Time Savage S eighty G one mile south of Bangkok, four hundred feet. Request clearance to transition Charlie airspace. Oh Bangkok at night, eh? That's the west side, and that's where the sun's going down. There's an airport right here. No, can't be that one that close. Let's see. 
This thing seems to fly pretty good. It's a little tricky. I had to put a bit of... Uh, that's Trim's level. There can't be an airport there. Holy jumping, there is. There is a tiny, tiny little strip there. Why on earth would they think they would need something that small? Unless it's for like a helicopter, but there's... A dive bomb in here, not what? There is seriously a little runway there. Wow, how would you... This thing would probably get in there, no problem, but anything else, oh boy. A pretty small plane, I think. She's uh, very wanting to go up this thing. Throttle back a bit. I just want to keep a lot of throttle on it because like, as soon as you let it off, she'll just... Oh, yeah. <laughs> she'll die quick. Pretty much come in for the landing at pretty well full throttle, I would say. Well, let's see what runway we've got close-ish to us. I don't want to take this thing too far, but... There should be... Bangkok's a pretty big place. If we can get to this one, uh, maybe up over here. Over by the water, maybe there. Or down here, there's a big one, too. That's the one we just took off from, I think. There, or no, maybe this one. That one there. Oh, I'll fly around for a bit. Check out old Bangkok. I'm sure a lot of people live here. Oh, my goodness. Wow. Quit the river system here, too. It looks like kind of interesting. This thing, gosh, you could almost probably land this thing on the roof of one of these buildings. <laughs> it's such a short landing. And that's uh, probably don't even really need any flaps down on it. It's just, that's just amazing. Just amazing, this plane, holy jumping. Perfect for what it's meant for, for, you know, jumping into a bush and taking off in, like, no runway. Oh, we're headed down maybe to the water here. Maybe we'll uh, follow this uh, river system here down, and then there was... Uh, uh, yeah, we'll follow this maybe down here, and then up the shoreline and then land the BTSU. This looks more like the downtown Bangkok coming up here. Look at this roof here. I bet you I could land on this roof here. I bet you I could. <laughs> I wonder if it'll crash me out, though. I bet you I could easily land on this roof here. This big long roof here is like cars, eh? Holy. Yeah, you don't need any uh, flaps, I don't believe. She just slows down these big tires and drag on them tires, slow you right down. I don't know if I want to land on here, though. I might end up crashing. That would kind of suck. Oh, uh, it's not very level. I don't think I'm going to land on it here. It could probably. Well, let's give her a try. We got these big tires on. Why not? Roof landing. <laughs> it actually did it. Oh, except I'm going the wrong way. Oh, it crashed it. Ah, I wonder if it was going to do that. Cause critical damage. Ah, oh, man. I didn't really want to do that, but oh well. <laughs> that was it. Very interesting. That's kind of a cool plane, that one. Uh, I do a little video part for you on uh, where I get them from here, but. Um, they're all free um, but um, my uh, recording software here doesn't record uh, desktop stuff anymore which really sucks because there's sometimes I like to use that for recording desktop stuff right but let's fire up here again and uh, I'm just gonna take off off the taxiway I think here let's see we need to Let's 
something there. That's a pretty cool plane, this one. Holy cow. From CGGNP Tree 022 with Golf Request Taxi for takeoff straight on departure. <laughs> it's up already. Holy jumping, eh? That's just crazy. <laughs> That's such a short takeoff. Oh my goodness. Some air speed up here. We're all good. Look at that. <laughs> oh man. That's pretty cool. Some kind of mountain way over there. If we change to the F-15, we can probably get over there pretty quick, too. This is pretty darn slow, this thing. 104 knots. I think that's where the uh, F-15 roughly starts to lift off at. So that little airport there, we'd have no problem getting in there. Let's fly around a little bit here. I'm going to put a little bit of flaps to down there. So I want to keep quite a bit of engine RPM, I think, up on this because, uh, boy, it does drop off so quick. Yeah, that's a that little tiny airport just behind us now. I can't believe there's an airport there. That seems odd. But. All kinds of airports really around here, I guess. I'd like to get something like a float plane. That'd be kind of interesting. I haven't seen any of them yet land well. We've got the one, you know, that's like the car looking one. I can't remember the name of it now, but uh, we got that one. But, um, you know, one that actually has like float skis on it. That'd be kind of interesting. Although, boy, this thing has so much air and buoyancy in these tires. I'll probably land this one on water, but then that's tail would sink in. You need some kind of floating thing there, I guess. Okay, let's try to get back over to uh, this river system over here. We'll kind of fall it down and find some of the land. What is that down below? It looks like a small golf course. Looks like someone's private little golf course. You've got water hazard. Imagine what they must pay for taxes for something like that. Just have a silly golf course in your backyard. <laughs> Holy cow. In this big, huge city here, it must just cost a fortune. That looks like a mall or something down below us there, maybe. Piles and piles of housing away. Oh my goodness. Wow. We'll head to the city center here. I guess that's probably what that is. Uh, where all the big, big wigs go to work every day, I'm sure, with their big tall buildings and stuff. Look at the houses jammed in right below us here. Oh my goodness. That's like Tent City almost. That's insane. I don't know how they could live like that. I guess you get used to it. All jammed to together tight like that. Eh? Wow. I don't know if it's 
some turbulence here too. I'm getting her just plain so sensitive. Try my best to keep her straight, but I think I'm getting a lot of turbulence. Seems like cruising at right around that 104-ish knots there. It's not too bad. It's not quite 200 mile an hour, I guess. Is that what that means on the inside of that dial, I guess? Yeah. There's the big cityscape. Might actually take us quite a while to fly down to the main water there. We'll uh, get there eventually, but uh, it's going to take us a few minutes. It's not very fast, this thing. Like the buildings down through here. Wow, we. A lot of them are like blacked out. I don't know if that's normal. Interesting, though. Huh? Right below us, that looks like a cemetery to me. Maybe not. Hard to say. I for sure absolutely don't know this area, so I have no clue what is what, what's the cemetery here, and <laughs> oh, that skinny little building right below us there. Wow, that's a tiny one. Holy cow. <laughs> skinny, skinny, skinny. big river. Boat's underwater too. Uh oh. See that? Looks like they're underwater. <laughs> oh, pardon me. Tickle in my throat. Oh, I know what'll help. I got one of those. Uh, when I was sick there. I got some, some of these. Uh, Honey Lemon Vix Cool drop thingies, and oh man, they ooh, they light you up, so I'll probably start sniffling here. <laughs> I'm going to drop one of them in, though, just to keep my throat from acting up. Now, that seems kind of funny. I guess they like the river, but why they wouldn't have blocked it off, like, by this big building on the right, and then over the other far side? far side somewhere and let that dry out and just run the river straight through the middle narrows here like they, they have but block these off and let it dry out I guess that would reduce all their shipping up above and stuff you know, behind us where all the boats are docked and stuff but that just seems funny to have this real narrow here like this oh yeah that thing's working oh man cleans you out that's for sure Oh, 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 they're brutal, those things. Those Vix. Made by Vix, it's like a cop candy kind of thing. Holy cow. It's vaporizing in my face. <laughs> oh. It kind of numb your throat a bit, so if you got a sore throat too, right? It'll uh, numb that for oh, probably, well, not too long, much longer after you finish the candy. But Oh, wow. Good stuff. It's burning pretty good. <laughs> oh, do you think we 
get under the bridge. Oh, I don't know about that one. <laughs> I don't know if I want to try that. It's not a very high bridge. I'll get down closer, but I think I'll go over the road. It looks kind of weird to me from here. I don't know if it's just the water or what, but... I could probably make it, but... Oh, that'd be skimming the road pretty close. I don't think I want to test that. <laughs> I want to get down here and land. There's really no boats out in the water, though, which is kind of interesting. I was just saying it for fly, nice though. For local close stuff, you know, jumping from airport to airport maybe or something, it's pretty slick. What I will do though is um, I'll put the link, a link to, um, oh, I was trying to get this burnout, <laughs> sorry, get the link to where I get these planes from. Uh, if you've got Microsoft Flight Simming, you can load them yourself. You have to, um, I think there's instructions on there. It's not super easy to start with. I think you have to make a folder in your Flight Sim directory. Um, or it's under, no, it's under Community, I think. You'll see a Community folder, I think it was, in your um, Flight Sim folder. All your mods will come as a zip file or a RAR file. You have to unzip them and just drag the folder out of that zip into that community folder and you'll see the game. It's pretty simple that way. There's no real installation stuff. But Boy, this is quite a river here. My goodness. I couldn't imagine how much this thing would slow down if you put full flaps down too. Holy man. You could probably just stop and just bunk down on the ground. <laughs> Super. I wonder if there's any places I can try the, that sometime, the bush landing stuff, you know. These little wee short little runways kind of thing. We good at that uh, St. Barth's we did there last time, I think it was. St. Martin. We good down there at that St. Barth's. So, holy jeez. That's a short runway there. I don't know what's going on over here straight ahead of us on the ground water. It's kind of interesting looking. It's like maybe a glitch or something. The water mountain. The water mountain. Uh -huh. Runway. Yeah, it's just up there, not too far. I'll fly up the coast here too, maybe. B T S U. Let's see if I can even see that on the. I uh, should be able to find it now. TSU, it is. Victor Tango Sierra Uniform Traffic CGG NP Tree 02215 miles east 500 feet inbound to land runway trade board. Nobody there remaining in the airport, I guess, so we'll just do that. Dark awful quick here too, isn't it? Wow, we sun's going down. Mm -hmm. I think 
got a little, <clears throat> pardon me, there we go. <laughs> got a little bit of a flight over there, 15 nautical miles. Not sure what all this watery stuff is right ahead of us here, but some kind of rice field, maybe, or something. I don't know. It's definitely odd. Kind of looks like water, anyway. Looks like the same water on the ocean on the left there. Yeah, it's flooded for something. I don't, I don't know why, but interesting. definitely see them on the map there too where I just flew over there's definitely something cut out of there for water there's an awful lot of streams through here too look at all the blue lines I guess are all the streams and stuff like that. going to be a nice sunset. I don't know whether we'll see the full sunset here by the time we get there or not, but it's going to be a nice sunset. Be a bit of turbulence or something pushing me around. I don't think it would take much wind to push this thing around too much either. And a light, right? Super light. Well, my whole throat is numb now. <laughs> From that candy. Oh boy. I kind of wonder, you know, that does that to your throat. What's that doing to, like, your tube that goes down into your stomach and into your stomach? Is that making that kind of go numb, too? You wouldn't even feel that. But. She's a bright sun. This is, I believe, it's live weather I've got on here, too. Is it live still? Yeah, live. Well, let's put it to live. Oh, oh wait a minute. That got real dark all of a sudden. That's weird. Let's put her back to about... Oh, that's nice, isn't it? There we go. I 
pattern entry. All right. Slowly getting there. There's your airport. That's good. Sam Sakon Sa Airport. I think I said that right, but I probably didn't. <laughs> I'm not sure. Ooh, the sun's going all wordly looking. That's kind of neat. She's actually past the airport. <clears throat> Interesting. I guess they want me to do that left hand entry or whatever they call it there. I'm just going to go right in and land dive bomb. <laughs> Pretty cool plane, I must say. I was enjoying flying this. Uh, other than the goofy looking rear big wheels, but uh, pretty cool. Seeing as there's nobody mining the airport, we'll just fly right in. Sun is almost down. Nice. Full flaps on here. See what happens. Jumping. You'd probably land this in a quarter of that runway if you really had to. 54 knots, that's it. I still got a bit of throttle on though. Just to keep it a little lofted. Bet you I could land pretty much before the 34 if that tree was right there. Oh, I flipped over, I put the brakes on. Oh, no! I forgot all about that tail dragger crap. Ah, oh, no. Anyways, that was a nice flight until I messed up. But I put the stupid brakes on and then just locked up and flipped over. But I definitely could have probably landed and stopped probably before that 34. Guaranteed. But, oh, man. Anyways, there's some more Microsoft Flight Sim for you with that cool plane. And uh, I will put a link to where I get those planes and stuff. Uh, I've got a few other planes here, too, actually. Let's have a look at them. Uh, uh, that's this guy here. 
Some of them are at the stock plane, so let's look through them here. Some of them I got off there, and they're, like, really, really bad. Like, this one wasn't too bad. Not the greatest. This is a stock uh, game one. The helicopter wasn't too bad. It didn't fly kind of like you think it would. I uh, still haven't flown this one yet. That's an in-game one. This is an in-game one. Uh, wait a minute now. Now, the uh, A380 isn't an in-game one. That's a, uh, a mod, too. Um, that one's an in-game one, though. And then the 747 here is an in-game. The Dash 8 was a mod. This is, I believe, an in-game. These, of course, are all the F-15s that I got. Different versions of them. In-game, uh, this one... Boy, I don't remember this one now. It was a mod. I know that, but I can't remember how it blew. These ones are the in-game ones. In-game, 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 in-game. Uh, that was... That was a mod, but I don't remember if I've flown that one yet. We'll have to try that maybe just before we go today. Just a quick little up and down or something. Uh, mod wasn't very good, this one. Just terrible. There's no, like, cockpit at all inside. It looks terrible. Uh, in game, in game, in game, and these are all in game ones. All these Cessnas are in games. This is the uh, C-17, the big, uh, big feller. Uh, I don't know if it'll show you a picture of it here. No, it doesn't. So uh, that's the big um, equipment one, I guess you could take in there with the, the big engines on it and stuff. Uh, of course, that one just flew, and then the uh, Savage, the Cub. Well, let's try this Raptor, no, F-14 here, sorry, yes, just quickly here. And it might even have been this one that wasn't so good. Let's go somewhere where the sun's a bit brighter, though, so we can see it. Sure, that'll work. And I'm just going to start right there on the end of the runway, I think. So it's already running for us, I don't have to do all that stuff. Okay. Let's load this up. It'll take a moment here. Oh, we'll just try this one. This is the one that the, the wings sweep, sweep back on it when you get, in, get going super fast on it. But uh, I can't think of actually... I, I know I put it in here, but I don't think I've actually tried it. So, we will give her a buzz here and see what happens. I know one of them I got... I can't remember which one. It was just terrible. Like, I should just take it out again. It was that bad. People race to get these things out I think they don't take time to to do things right and I don't think you could even start it up yourself if you had to start at the end of the runway it wouldn't start Hydro bad tower, CGG, NP3, yeah zero, this one two, two, I think is it straight out departure just, just absolutely terrible there's no noise I I don't know this one's definitely needing some work it looks good from the outside the wheels don't even turn I think it's actually st starting itself up Yeah, it's not even running either. Like, oh my goodness. Let's just see what happens if we... Uh, it's moving anyways, but... Oh, just... Just to cut... Bottle of the thing, you know. It doesn't even have sound. I don't know. They release these things. They shouldn't really be doing that. The flaps aren't even coming down. <laughs> Let's see if she even lifts off. Yeah, it definitely needs, should be going a lot faster than that too by now. Sometimes people should just not maybe put a mod out. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, that's it for today. Oh, and I should take that one out, the F-14. F-14, right? Yeah, F-14. Okay, but anyways, that's it for today. Thanks again for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed that flight. Pretty cool plane, and uh, we'll catch you all later, and you guys have a good day.